So every now and then we have to have, take a moment and share a special message with coaches because coaches coaches are great they i think they have good intentions at their heart in their hearts uh and i believe them to largely be good men with a few notable exceptions of course but they also sometimes you just don't know what they're thinking when they decide to talk because coaches are funny for the most part 75 85 90 percent of the things they will say are empty words they mean nothing but then in that other 10%, sometimes you get some good genuine comments that either reflect the truth or honest feelings about something. And sometimes you get stuff that you say, why are you saying this? What's really your motivation here? Why, why are you even bothering with this? I like talking about, oh, I don't know, negative recruiting. Because here's the thing. Everybody does it. And there are varying degrees of negative recruiting and there are varying definitions of negative recruiting. But if you say something about another school to a recruit and you say it, that's not necessarily something positive, that's negative recruiting. And everybody does it and it's not a fault, really. Uh, I would do it too. You would do it too. If a, if a recruit is looking at your school and another school, wouldn't you tell them why your school is better than the other school? You would. I would think. I certainly would. And I think that probably the other school would classify that as negative recruiting. Now, there are varying degrees. You can get pretty nasty about it. And certainly some coaches engage in that, sometimes calculated, sometimes out of frustration. But everybody does it. And that's the thing. When you go out and then talk about it publicly and talk about how you are getting negative recruited against or other schools are using things to recruit against you, and there are plenty of coaches who have made these Mm, comments we'll call them over the last few years it comes across as either whining or making excuses and no one wants to hear you whine or make excuses and the worst is if you know administration gets involved athletic directors chancellors those kinds of things they really should stay out of the picture but coaches don't don't talk about these things don't whine about these things because you just it just comes across as whining it's the same thing with talking about recruits who are committed to one school and take visits to another Guess what? You recruit recruits who are committed to other schools. So if you're going to do that, don't get upset that your recruits might go visit other schools as well. There are some things I'd like coaches to open up more about and talk more honestly about. These things, probably best to just leave those unsaid.